Okay, what we're looking at here is a gasket out of a manifold gauge set hose. Now you can see we've got some ends kind of tore off there and so on. Uh, this gasket is getting worn out. It's really just a little short piece of quarter inch rubber tube. Uh, but we are going to go ahead and replace that and I'll show you how it's done. Okay, this is what the uh, gasket looks like when it's installed in the hose. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pull it out. Uh, kind of want to be careful, don't damage the parts of the hose. This is your new one here. Uh, it just fits in where the other one was. Uh, I mean, this is no big deal to do or anything like that. A uh, couple of precautions I'll show you on these things. There you can see the new gasket installed in the hose. The next thing you do is mount it on the gauge set. Give it a good tighten down to get it seated in there. Uh, do all six of them when you do any of them. And note one thing. Uh, here's your... Uh, okay. Uh, you notice that depressor in there. This one has a new gasket in it. Uh, in some cases that depressor could just fall out when you take this out of here uh, when you take the get old gasket out be sure that uh, is replaced in there otherwise it will not depress your Schrader and you'll get some odd ideas of what's going on in your system <clears throat> also when you put these new gaskets in they're oftentimes not seated in real well <clears throat> So if uh, you're hooking this up to a unit and you're blowing refrigerant off and nitrogen and so on, uh, recheck these things a couple of times and make sure they are still in there because sometimes they'll blow out uh, when you blow either nitrogen or refrigerant out. So watch that. Uh, that's true on new sets too. When you get a new set, it's very common. I've had a number of people did not know the gasket was missing and went ahead and tightened it down got a small leak couldn't figure out why they had a small leak kept tightening it down and eventually ruined the hose uh, so watch those gaskets those gaskets probably need to replay be replaced at least every season sometimes within the season uh, get you a package of these things uh, like this here uh, and uh, carry it with you so if you lose one or one gets screwed up you can replace it uh, and like I said it, certainly at the beginning of the uh, cooling season I would replace all of them uh, while I'm doing it I would be checking the entire gauge set for leaks uh, may want to do that every month or so anyway but that's the gaskets and that's what your bad one looks like uh, getting pretty toasty here. Okay, replace the gaskets.